okay so this is the question number second the second question is given for the system of four capacitors shown in shown in figure there are four capacitors three microfarad six two and four we need to calculate the equivalent capacitance let us solve the equation uh, the a part first okay so as simple you can see in the figure we'll we will redraw this figure first okay so three and six this three and this six are in are in series or parallel they are in series so if we solve these two then it will give me one capacitance and then if we solve this two and four they will give me one capacitance and uh, there is another it is 90 volts okay so i need to calculate first three microfarad series six microfarad three microfarad series six microfarad so if if i need to calculate this i need to put the formula one by c equivalent equals to one by c1 plus one by c2 that means one by c equivalent one by three plus one by six that means one by c equivalent will take the lcm so 1 by c equivalent equals to 3 by 6 that means 1 by c equivalent equals to 1 by 2 that means can i write it 2 microfarad like this okay so this one is 2 microfarad now 2 microfarad and 4 microfarad are in series so 2 microfarad series 4 microfarad they are in series so can I write it 1 by C equivalent equals to 1 by C1 plus 1 by C2. That means 1 by C equivalent equals to 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4. So 1 by C equivalent equals to 4, 2 plus 1. So 1 by C equivalent equals to 3 by 4. So can I write C equivalent equals to 4 by 3 microfarad. Okay. So, can I write it? This one is 4 by 3 microfarad. Okay. And now, these two, 2 and 4 by 3 are in parallel. So, what will happen? I will get a circuit like this. And this is the 90 volt. And it must be the, the equivalent capacitance. So, 2 microfarad and 4 by 3 are in parallel so now i can write that 2 microfarad parallel with 4 by 3 microfarad so i can write c equivalent equals to c1 plus c2 so c equivalent equals to 2 plus 4 by 3 that means i will take the lcm so 6 plus 4 so c equivalent equals to 10 by 3 that means if I if I calculate 10 divided by 3, it comes to C equivalent equals to 3.33 microfarad. So the equivalent circuit will be 3.33 microfarad. So this is the answer of the first part. Okay. Now the B part the charge on each capacitor b part the charge on each capacitor always remember there are two type of circuit the series i explained you the series suppose series is this one uh, sorry i need to make the capacitor so these are the series okay and suppose the parallel okay so this is the series combination this is the parallel combination always remember when we are talking about series okay here in parallel when you see the parallel potential is same okay potential is same and charge is different okay in series it's opposite 
potential is different but the charge is same okay always remember this we will use this thing here okay now in this case the charge on each capacitor so basically three and six are um, in series okay so series means q will be same q will be same so whatever will be the q q will be the same but in parallel q is different okay so how how we will find out again we will go to this figure yes so we will take this figure now this one in this figure basically you can see 2 and 4 by 3 are in parallel right that means if they are in parallel that means their charge will be see the parallel combination charge will be different okay so let us let us make this figure here again 2 and this is 4 by 3 and there is a potential here okay so this this is basically and this potential is 90 volt so suppose i need to find out q1 and i need to find out q2 so what will be my q1 we know the formula q equals to c v right we know this formula q equals to c v now what is the capacitance 2 what is voltage is 90 okay then q1 will be equals to 180 micro coulomb okay now q2 q2 equals to see what is this 4 by 3 is the capacitance c or voltage is 90 so it will be just cancel out so it will be q2 will be equal to 120 micro coulomb okay so now we we got the q1 and we got the q2 that means q1 2 up uh, now you can see this 2 microfarad this 2 microfarad is the series combination of 3 microfarad and 6 microfarad that means in series when two capacitors are in series the what is basically the what happens when the two capacitors are in series what happens the charge is same so whatever is the charge whatever is the charge 180 micro coulomb will be across it will be same across 3 and 6 micro farad so let us write the answer of b how to write the answer of b this is the b part we are solving now yes this is the b part we are solving so for b part q1 is 180 coulomb so answer will be 180 micro coulomb will be charge will be across what are the capacitance across 3 and 6 microfarad okay 3 and 6 microfarad and next is 120 micro coulomb charge will be across what are the two other capacitance here 2 and 4 microfarad 2 microfarad and 4 microfarad so this is the answer of b part okay now the c part What is the C part? The potential difference across each capacitor. Okay. Tell me what will be the potential difference across each capacitor? How to solve it? Again, we will see charges in potential different. Potential differences different in series combina combination and same in parallel combination. Okay. So, they are in parallel so that means 2 microfarad and 4 by 3 microfarad is the same okay that means i can write i can write 90 volt is same across 2 and 
4 by 3. 4 by 3 or 3 by 4? I'm a bit confused. What is that? 4 by 3 microfarad. 2 microfarad and 4 by 3 microfarad. 90 volt. Okay. But now, 2 microfarad is basically the series combination of 2 capacitance and 4 by 3 microfarad is the series combination of 2 capacitance. So, what are the series of two, 3 and 6 and 2 and 4? Okay. This is 3, 6 and 2 and 4. Now, I need to find in series. So, look. In series, V is different. Okay. In series, V is different. So, suppose you need to find the V across 3 microfarad capacitor. How you will find? We know the formula. Q equals to CV. So, so what will be V? It will be Q over C. So, V equals to, what is Q? What is a Q? This is C. What is a Q? Q, what, what is the Q, what, what we find out the Q? 180. So, it is 180 over 3. So, it is 60. 60 will be the answer. Okay. And across, now V across, so it will be millivolts. And V across 6 microfarad capacitor. What it will happen? Again, Q equals to CV. V equals to Q by C. So, V equals to, what is Q? How much Q we, we took out? Oh, Q is again the same, 180. 180 over 6. So, V equals to 30 millivolts. So, V equals to 30 millivolts. V equals to 60 millivolts. So, this is across 3 and 6. Okay. And now I need to find out for 2 and 4. So, V across 2 microfarad capacitor. How I will find out? Q equals to CV. V equals to Q by C. And now the Q, what will be the Q? We, we found out the Q. 120 microcoulomb. Okay, so V equals to 120 divided by, what is the capacitance? 2. So V equals to 60 millivolts. And now we need to find V across 4 microfarad capacitor. Then Q equals to CV. V equals to Q by C. That means 120 divided by four that means 30 millivolts so there are basically four this is the answer this is the answer this is the answer and this is the answer okay so this way we need to solve this type of question